Well, we found out this morning after the Madeleine Mayer debacle, the Prime Minister is relaunching the application process for the Ethics and Lobbying Commissioner. It should be a clear indication to everyone the Prime Minister and his backroom operatives floated the Mayer trial balloon, hoping it would work and that they would simply fill these positions with Liberal Party donors and insiders. Parliament is not a Liberal partisan playground. When will the Prime Minister start a meaningful search to fill these five positions that are open, and when will he consult with opposition parties like he's supposed to? The Honourable Government House Leader. Mr. Speaker, as I, I have said, we have put in place a new process, an open, transparent and merit-based process, so that Canadians can apply. We recognize the importance of these positions, exactly what we committed to Canadians we have delivered on. Under this new process, we have appointed over 150 great Canadians doing the important work that we know that they do. The good news is, is that this place is no longer a Conservative playground. We believe in nonpartisan appointments. We believe in merit-based appointment process, and that's why we put it into place. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Honourable Member for Barry Innisfil. You. Well, you can bet, uh, Mr. Speaker, that if the Prime Minister was looking for a social media coordinator, that this position would have been filled in a heartbeat. So what has <laughs> the Prime Minister's uh, been his priority over the last 620 29 days, if not filling these positions. Cash for access fundraisers, a taxpayer-funded jet-set lifestyle, sending billions of Canadian tax dollars overseas, Broadway shows, stage photo ops, daytime TV appearances, and severe ethical lapses. When will the Prime Minister put down the selfie stick and get to work by appointing independent non-partisan officers of Parliament? Exactly. Honourable Government House Leader. Has been and always will be Canadians, middle class Canadians, and those working hard to join it. And that's exactly why the first thing we did when we took office was to lower taxes on the middle class by increasing taxes on the 1% of wealthiest Canadians. What did the Conservatives do? They voted against it. Mr. Speaker, we have put in a new process, an open, transparent, merit based process. All available positions that are, are available or posted online, I encourage Canadians to apply. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.